nights. Just moments ago, the former president formally appealed the civil fraud ruling against him here in New York. Let's get right to MSNBC legal correspondent Lisa Rubin. Lisa, what do we know about this appeal? So, Anna, what Trump filed this morning and his co-defendants with him are two notices of appeal. One is at Judge Angoron's decision and order. That's that 92-page decision in which he found Trump and his co-defendants liable for six additional counts of fraud in their business dealings in the Trump Organization over a period of almost a decade. He has also now appealed the judgment that was entered late last week. That judgment reduced the dollar amount, as you know, to $464 million and counting by the day with each additional day for added judgment. We don't see a brief yet. That's because Trump, under ordinary New York civil procedure rules, has six months to, what, to do what's called perfecting the appeal. That's filing a brief, filing the trial record with the appellate court. And the other thing that we know right now is what we haven't seen. We haven't seen any indicia of an undertaking or a bond that Trump and his co-defendants have posted in the amount of the underlying award.